Okay, Von Bell, safety, 2016 NFL Draft. Let's start with the 20th pick in the first round with the New York Jets. Number 20, New York Jets. 21, Washington. 22, Houston. 26, Seattle. 27, Green Bay. 30, Carolina. 31, Denver Broncos. Denver Broncos, and he sneaks into the first round. I didn't want to let him get to the second round because I thought that this guy might take him pick number one in the second round. I think Bob Bell is probably the best safety in the draft, and I realize that safety is not a position that's valued as highly as some others on defense in the NFL. But Bob Bell, I think, has the cover skills of a cornerback, mm -hmm. which makes him a much more valuable pick as a safety. And at the end of the first round, he's a guy who maybe later in his career couldn't move to corner, and I think you draft that kind of upside in the first round. Yeah, I know we're not talking about the NFL, but I think Denver would be a good spot for him too because they've had a lot of veteran DBs yeah. and it let him. I, you were right. I was going to go early in the second round. I was probably going to pick him at uh, the second pick in, in the because I know that technically Cleveland has the, whatever. I was going to go with the second pick in the second round. I think that the thing that I was most impressed about Von Bell is that he always had an inherent ability to be around the ball and to make plays. He'll be the first one to tell you that. But I do think that, like, we're talking about Eli Apple and why I wouldn't take him. I thought Don Bell had a more tangible effect on Ohio State's defense. Von Bell is at the top of the list of guys who I've changed my mind on the wrong way hmm. since the NFL stuff started. I thought he was a huge playmaker on the Ohio State defense. Um, and I think I feel like he's lost his mojo a little bit. When he came out the combine and said the first thing he sat down with scouts, they said, what was up with your run defense? And he said, I was lazy in run defense. Um, and then I didn't think he had a great pro day workout at Ohio State. He didn't pop hmm. in that group of Ohio State talent like I would want a first round or two. I would have thought coming off the season, I would have taken him like 23 of the Minnesota Vikings. And, and I don't know that he's a first rounder now. He's a little, he's, he's like 5'10", he's not huge. You know, he's fast, but he didn't burn it up. Um, running his 40, I don't think. So I do think he's a playmaker, but I think there's lots of guys in the NFL draft who are playmakers. you got to show me a little more with the, uh, the skill set, and I think it hasn't been what I thought it would be in what we've seen at the Combine and approach.